Well, hello and welcome to Drive It Day. Drive It Day is an event, um, sort of organ or events more like, organised by the Federation of British Historical Vehicle Clubs. They encourage you to get out in your classics. So we are, we're out in Giselle today. It's absolutely filthy, but uh, such is life. We're very dusty conditions at the moment. We're going to have a walk down the line, see what else is in the lineup. I've uh, got one of these aluminium bodied Jagex J's. Really, really nice buttermilk 2CV that was at the 2CV event we were at last weekend. Uh, that's not entirely a classic, the old Peugeot there, but MGB. Um, fairly early one, a very early one. It's got the pull handle doors. It looks like someone's fitted the actual holding, um, folding hood. Uh, when these came out, you had a kit of parts. So yeah, that is a very early MGB. Very nice. Yeah, B plate, that is around 64, and they came out in 62, I think. Uh, Austin A35, like spotted by the um, larger rear window and the body colour grill. Like Lovely Alfa Romeo GTV 2000. Beautiful car, a Ferrari 358, are they? I don't even know. Sierra Cosworth. We've got something very meaty coming in by the sound of it. Oh, look at that, Jaguar D-type replica. It's not a genuine one, but it's... Uh, very nice nonetheless. Whoa, Jaguar D type. Yeah, yeah, Miss Hub not going crazy for the um, Sierra Sapphire Cosworth. It's got the old um, Moret um, uh, quad headlamps, a later MGB rubber bumper, gorgeous little frog eye sprite. Not my Volvo is here joining us today. And um, I'm especially excited to see this Vauxhall that's actually a Holden, the VXR8. We, we saw this when we did our video of Newcastle Emlyn, we actually saw this. So we could have bought Betty and we could have had a proper Australian car session. Um, Mercedes-Benz SLK, uh, Ford Cortina twin cam, so that's a Lotus Mark II. So many of these Mark II Lotus Cortinas have been done up in the same paint scheme as the Mark Ones. So I like that in red. A uh, little Morris 8, uh, Triumph TR coming in. Uh, TR4A with the independent rear suspension. Yeah, gorgeous little Morris 8 Tora, very rare. I think that was on the last run. And I think the convoy today is going to be led by this Daimler V8. Uh, so it's got the big bumpers, so technically that's a two and a half litre uh, reference to the engine. Later became a V8 250. Uh, Citroën Synergy, there's a rare sight. So uh, yeah, I think that's going to be leading us today. This event here is organised by the Cardigan classic car club but like i say this is drive it day and then we've got this amazing triumph acclaim cd uh very very nice condition these, these rot so readily they've kind of almost entirely vanished but the triumph acclaim was the start of the relationship between british leyland and honda and this was the first endeavor of that it's basically a honda ballad which is basically a civic saloon and oh, little Spitfire coming in. Lovely. Okay. Spitfire Mark IV there. And the Mark IVs had a 1.3 litre engine shared with the Triumph Herald. But yeah. I think the seats in these were locally produced, but really it was a kit of parts from Japan. But led to, um, yeah, some very, very good cars. The Rondas, as we know them. Not really JDM, but it is, well, I suppose you could buy one in Japan, but would have fender mirrors sprouting out of here. Okay, that's kind of cool. And uh, so that would definitely be JDM. You could even get the Hondas with a rear wiper. <laughs> Very exciting. Did you see the Synergy going that way? I did see the Synergy, and I did comment on the Synergy. But yeah, this is our little road run. We're going to head off and have a lovely drive in the countryside. So here come the classics. Uh, we are here in Cardigan. Uh, we've just jumped ahead of the queue just to watch them come through, the Daimler V8. Uh, the SLK, the Triumph Acclaim. TR4, the little Morris 8 bug eye. The Lotus Cortina. Holden. Effectively, my first S. There's not my Volvo. Little Frog Eye, MGB, Kodze, Ferrari 360, my era. Here comes the Alfa Romeo, 
A little lost in A35, he's going to have to stop. There the MGV. Tussiri! Marvellous. Uh, we've got the uh, X350, I think, Jaguar XJ. The D-type replica. Nice. Uh, XK8 on the back, and I think the last car through is going to be a Rover P4. Uh, oh, no, we've still got the Triumph Spitfire as well. There's a drive it day convoy coming the other way. Is that MX5 Mark 1. Yeah. Oh, Mark 1 Escort. Oh. Oh, yes. Yeah, nice. Nice. Trump Stack. Mark 3 Cortina. Nice. Oh, yeah, I'm liking that run very much. What? Are we switching? Are yeah, let's turn around and we'll go follow them. Is that Pembrokeshire going to Cardigan and Cardigan going to Pembrokeshire? Could be, couldn't awesome. it? Awesome. Oh, Trump's the R3A. Yeah, so not like the one that's um, in our... That's the predecessor of the Red Triumph in our group. Oh, there's a Morris Oxford Series 2 coming down. What became the Hindustan Ambassador. Loving that. Oh, loving that. Very early MGB again. Standard 10 coming down. I'll try and back off a bit. There we go. There's the 10. Another Spitfire. Uh, Mark 3 Golf GTI. Uh, Triumph TR4. No, TR5. Uh, Triumph Herald 1360. Little Mini. Mark 2 Escort. MGTF. Oh, yeah, this is fun. Morgan, another modern Morgan, Lotus Elise. Oh, young lad driving that one. That's yeah, fun. Master MX5 Mark III, Aston Martin thing. Spitfire, oh, I reckon that might have a GT6 engine in it. Big bonnet bulge. And we've got uh, MGB, MGF. Another Mercedes Benz SLK, they're quite popular apparently. Ford Pop or oh, Anglia or something. Hey, they can... Mark II Escort again. They do have a Mark III Gold. Maybe we'll see them again when we're driving home. Triumph yeah. Test coming along now. Earlier Mercedes Benz SLK. Triumph TR6. I love Giselle South and Fierce. Wall's going so slowly. I know. I'm going to hold the gear because we're going uphill. Yeah, thanks cyclists. Oh, more classics coming, I think. Yep, little Austin A30, I think. I know, A30. Yeah, it is an A30, E Type Jag, oh. MGB GT, Rover 25, MG yeah. ZS. I think that was a hub nutter. I think that might have been a Figaro. Another Aston Martin Mini. Uh, another MGB T. Uh, Chrysler Crossfire, Mark II Golf Rally, I think. Oh, look at the Rovers. Yeah, another MG ZS. Right, so ZR, sorry. This is a big group. We've what only got a tiny group. Oh, oh. Triumph TR4, Triumph 2000, Dolomite, MX5. Oh yeah, this is cracking. We've got a five part in that. Oh, Series 3 Land Rover. Mark 1 Fiesta, oh, that's yeah. beautiful. Here they come again. Here comes that D type. Whoa. The Spitfire XK8. And that's us done because this is the last car. Here comes the P4 we missed earlier.
Marvellous. Oh, and the Morris Eight has become tail end Charlie. Marvellous. Right, run, 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 run. So that's it. That was our drive it day report. Cars are still um, parking up uh, variously. But yeah, it's been an absolute pleasure. So thank you, Cardigan Classic Car Club, for hosting us. And uh, yeah, we look forward to seeing you in a future video with some more automotive action. Farewell.